Good morning guys, this is your Sir DRB again and welcome back for another Nikkei video. So for today, we're going to talk about skills, skills upgrade, and what are these boxes for? So this code manual selection box. So uh, with the quests that we have and some other events, they are giving us this code manual selection box. And uh, well, there's actually quite a few who's asking what is this for? So let me show you how this is used so before we use that let me just um, explain to you what are these so um, as you can see there are um, icons or depictions for each of these and for example this one is HSTA well you can just say this is um, code manual for fire uh, Nikkei so this is fire water and this is wind and lightning and iron you can also check what are the Nikkei's uh, included on specific tier like that so let me just show you if you click on the power on the upper right hand corner you will see here the code okay so for example fire water and then wind and then electric so these are your Nikkei's which has this specific code all right so now that you know those specific code now let's go to uh, how you can use that um, code manual so for example what I'd like to upgrade is uh, my litter as you can see my skill right now is level 4 and I want to upgrade this uh, litter boost as you can see here um, the reason why I want to upgrade this first above anyone else is because um, when you're entering full burst, uh, this gives uh, tons of buffs. So as you can see, the cooldown of burst skill is reduced. If um, it's three times, the cooldown of burst is actually reduced to 3.17 seconds. So this is actually pretty great for... Um, bursting down your enemy so the lower the burst skill timer and the much faster or much higher the damage your team will uh, hit the enemy aside from that uh, litter has some other boosts as well as you can see max ammunition critical damage and three times attack 8.17 seconds for five seconds so it's actually uh, a tons of boost so what are the requirements for level 5 so as you can see now I have this skill manual 2 which I farm and the DMTR code manual uh, this is iron manual so I've used up uh, 12 all right so let's check upgrade this to level 5 all right, so as you can see now the skill is level five and these are the requirement for level six. Wow, this is actually a lot. Um, <laughs> 90 of the skill manual two, 126 of skill manual one and 15 of the iron. So next up, I just want to give you some tip guys. Um, once you hit at least day 12, day 12 on the day by day event because right now I'm day 13 you can actually get privity and privity is actually a, a pretty good a DPS aside from that not only he uh, she is good a, a DPS character she is also giving out buffs attack buffs which greatly enhances by litter so let's go back to this skill look at his ex magazine so this skill one affect all enemies uh, affect all allies cast when entering full burst so the attack is plus 20.38 for 30 seconds which is actually pretty good so if you're if you have been using uh rappy as your main damager before then once you have privity i i i guess I think it should be the time for you to change your main damager from Rappi to Peribity. 
All right, so let's upgrade this. All right, so look at that. All right, so now we're going to talk about where to get uh, those skill manuals for upgrade. So the, on uh, the only uh, way for you to get that is by going into the arc and then going into the simulation room. So each level of simulation room or difficulty, you can get um, rewards. So as you can see, I've already cleared one, two, three, and I haven't unlocked uh, four yet, maybe uh, later. So yeah, for one, it's just blue. For two, it's purple, you can get purple. And uh, for three, you can also get some uh, purple. And aside from that, you can get the specific code for iron, water, fire, and so on. So yeah, make sure you're doing this simulation room daily. Unfortunately, right now, there is no auto for simulation, so it's kind of uh, time-consuming for us to do this daily. But yeah, make sure to do this daily because uh, um, if you miss one day, it will be a lot and you, you might get left behind. Alright, so aside from that, there are other events that give those... Um, manual codes like this one the S code manual selection box we were given this code uh code manual selection box before i haven't used mine yet but maybe in the future once i have uh, tons of those uh code 2 and code 3 then i might use this to upgrade the skills of my uh, nikkei all right so that's just a quick um tip for you on how you can or, or where to use this uh code manual selection box because i know uh if you if you're new to the game we are given this box uh, right I, I think it's 30 pieces or something like that so you, you don't know where to use it right so this is how you use this code manual selection box all right so thank you very much guys for watching that's all for now and uh, keep uh if you're new to my channel, please hit that like button, subscribe for more. And also, if you have other questions about Nikkei, please leave it down in the comment below. And I'll be sure to create a video or reply back to you as soon as I can, okay? Thank you very much. I'll see you again. Goodbye for now.